Can you hear me, Solid Snake? He's oh yeah, I can move the mic. Yeah. Do you know who I am? I always knew that one day I would meet you. The man who stole the light from my life because of you! Forget it. Your body is strapped down tight. Me? Why, I'm the man from whom you stole everything good. And now, after the sacrifice of our brothers, after 30 long years, finally, the two of us meet. The brother of light and the brother of dark. Do you need his genetic information too? Yes. I want a sample while he's still alive. We need it to correct the genome soldier's mutations. Then we'll be able to cure them? No. We still have to get our hands on Big Boss's DNA. Boss. Ooh, ooh. Have they given in to our demands yet? Not yet. They won't give in. They're all hypocrites. Every one of them. Is that your opinion as a Kurd? They always put politics first. That's right. That's why they want to avoid any leak about their precious new nuclear weapon. Boss, it looks like our friend is awake. I'm awake! Let me out. Why is my shirt off? <laughs> there definitely is a resemblance. Don't you think, little brother? <laughs> Snakes is like what? Oh my god, we have the same goddamn face. Or should I say big brother? I'm not sure. Anyway, it doesn't matter. You and I are both the last surviving sons of Big Boss. It's me. Really? Then what? <clears throat> Those idiots! All right, Raven. I'll be right there. It's weird seeing him and me looking exactly the same, because in the original you couldn't see anybody's to our details in their face. We'll launch the first one in ten hours as planned. Damn Americans. Looks like you read them wrong. His hand. <laughs> Something's funny. Normally, the Americans are the first ones to the negotiating table. They must think they've got something up their sleeves. So it's come down to it, has it? We're gonna launch that nuke and ride it all the way into history. I've got to take care of some launch preparations. You're in charge here, Ocelot. What about you? Wanna stay for the show? I'm not interested. Damn, why are you checking me out? It's time to feed the family. So, you prefer your wolves to my show, hmm? Mm-hmm. Ocelot, don't screw up like you did with the chief. <laughs> Yes, I know. That was an accident. I didn't think a pencil pusher like him would be so tough. Well, his mental defenses were reinforced by hypnotherapy. Boss, what about that ninja? You're that ninja. He's killed 12 men. Whoever he is, <laughs> he's some kind of lunatic. Bastard took my hand. How could he have gotten in here? How did Snake get in here? Perhaps there's a spy among us. Mantis is dead. We've also got to find out what killed Baker and Octopus. We're short-handed, so make this little torture show of yours as short as possible. I like that he's just saying this in front of me. <laughs> torture? This is an interrogation. 
<laughs> As you wish. See you later, brother. What are you doing? You seductive little seductress. Whoa! Your woman is still in this world. Meryl. <laughs> what are you doing? Always says like I don't know, she says something to him, but it's not like this. Once she picks a target, she doesn't think about anything else. Not even you ask a lot. Sometimes she even falls in love with them before she kills them. Finally, just the two of us. How are you feeling? Not bad. Caught a nice nap on this revolving bed of yours. Too bad I was sleeping alone. Glad to hear that. This is some bed, all right. I'm about to show you some of its nicer features. Where are my things? Oh, don't worry. They're all there. In that box. <laughs> Washington was taking quite a chance sending you here. Someone must have a lot of faith in your skill, hmm, carrier boy? Huh? So, Metal Gear is armed with a carrier new type boy. of nuclear warhead, huh? Why don't you go ask Campbell for the full story? The Colonel? By the way, you got an optical disc from President Baker, didn't you? What if I did? Is that the only disc? There's no other data? What do you mean? There's no copy? If not, that's fine. Is Meryl okay? She's not dead yet. Thanks to Wolf's whim, but it's up to you if you want her to stay that way. You were holding one card key. Where are the other two? What's the trick behind that key? Trick? That weasel of a president said there's some kind of trick to using the key. Hell if I know. Also, I didn't want to get see. into No problem then. Not so good we are going to play a game, Solid Snake. And we'll find out what kind of man you really are. When the pain becomes too great to bear, just give up and your suffering will end. But if you do, the girl's life is mine. You can literally do that. You can literally choose to give up and Meryl dies. And at the end of the game, Otacon goes with you. And if you don't give up, then at the end of the game, Meryl goes with Press you. Press the resist button repeatedly to regain your strength. When you've had enough, press the surrender button to button submit. When your life reaches zero, the game is over. There are no continues, my friend. Don't even think about using auto fire, or <laughs> I'll know. Come on, I won't what? tell. Why don't you just give up? I'm going to run a high voltage electric current through your body. If it's just for a short time, it won't kill you. Did you know that it was the French who first thought of using electrical shocks as a means of torture? Hey, French films are all right, but I don't care about that crap. Mm, you're a tough guy, Snake. But I've got some bad news for you. You're no POW. You're a hostage. There's no Geneva Convention. No one is coming to save you. 
Starting to feel a little scared? Good. You should be. No. Okay. Let's get started. Oh man, I don't want to kill him. What's the button? Okay, that was my fault. I didn't know which How button I was getting like confused that? by the top right. Shall we go I'm probably again? gonna die. Yet. Oh, we're not finished yet. Motherfucker, he's gonna kill me. Oh, I got a break. But then we go again. You're a strong man. Well, that's enough for now, I think. <laughs> the picture on the screen is You're me. the boss's brother, all right. Your brother. He's an amazing man. Who else could shoot down two F-16s with a chopper? The Les Enfants Terribles project was not a total failure. He is the one man who could make my dream into a reality. What are you, what are you telling me this for? Little fox hound stickers, I love it. Or little logos. 